Brown's doctor, Eugene Gosey. In a grand jury indictment unsealed today, Gosey faces 166 counts from unlawfully distributing controlled substances to health care fraud. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Ali Tui has the latest now on this unprecedented case here in western New York. Dr. Eugene Gosey repeatedly wrote prescriptions that harmed dozens and in severe cases even caused the deaths of six of his patients. That's according to this 43-page federal indictment unsealed Wednesday. To um, sort of be given these drugs, be given these instrumentalities of death and, set, and basically sent on their way, I think is largely irresponsible. How? Prosecutors say Gosey repeatedly ignored red flags surrounding patient care, including requests for early refills and requests for particular drugs. The patients who died in this case aren't named in the federal indictment, but prosecutors say they don't fit a specific patient profile. They all range in age and the amount of time they were allegedly seen by Dr. Gosey. In a statement, Gosey's attorney said he has, quote, helped tens of thousands of patients suffering from debilitating painful illnesses and injuries. All medical care has risks, especially when a patient does not follow physician instructions. Every patient death is a tragedy. Thankfully, due to the safeguards Dr. Gosey's office has in place, his rate of patient overdose death is far below the national average. The indictment says Gosey allegedly committed health care fraud when he claimed he supervised patient treatment for insurance benefits to the tune of $245,000, but was not in Buffalo at the time of the appointments. What better way to commit a crime than have the government uh, sort of reimburse you for um, the, the poison that you're spilling out there into the streets? Gosey hasn't yet been arraigned on the new charges. If convicted, he faces 20 years to life in federal prison. In Buffalo, Allie Tui, 7 Eyewitness News.